been in trouble with UW Madison officials before, but school records show that he was never reprimanded for it. Preparation know. for an estate hey, sale is underway at John Chatham's Madison home. We knocked on the door. No one was there, and a source tells me Chatham may have left the state for good. Chatham resigned from UW Madison last month after a male student employee accused him of sexually assaulting him during a trip to the Rose Bowl last December. And Dane County investigators are looking into two more allegations of sexual misconduct against him. Now, a new twist. The Wisconsin State Journal is reporting that in 1998, Chatham allowed star football player Mike Samuel to drive his truck drunk. The school said Chatham would receive a written reprimand. School records show that never happened. Yeah, oh, it's super disappointing. It's kind of embarrassing. I think that, you know, it's pretty despicable. However, for that to occur. I tried contacting several officials here at the school for comment. No one wanted to speak with me on camera. Although I did reach assistant athletic director Justin Doherty by phone. Kelly, I'm not going to have a comment on it while I'm driving in the car. Thanks. Also unveiled today, text messages from the Rose Bowl trip that appear to confirm Chatham threatened to fire an employee if he didn't come to his room. You are fired, Chatham wrote, sending you home on a Greyhound tomorrow. Another text said, you have five minutes to get your your expletive to my room or you're fired. And again, a Dane County judge is now looking into two more allegations of misconduct against John Chatama. On your side at the UW Madison campus, I'm Shelley Walcott, today's TMJ4.